Hello and welcome to today's overview of agentic AI in ITSM. AI agents are autonomous units of digital labor. ITCIOs can now rely on systems of these AI agents to complete their work more productively and more effectively, driving outcomes like resilience, employee experience, and agent productivity. Well, how does it work? Let's take a look at the ServiceNow AI agent architecture. It all starts at the highest level, the agentic workflow. This could be something like resolving an incident, triaging an incident, wrapping up an incident, with an automated trigger, like an incident getting created, that kicks off the AI agent orchestrator, a virtual manager, to pick the right AI agents, that then pick the right tools, things like now assist skills, flows, scripts, and other pieces of data like a search retrieval for information, example being knowledge base articles, either on or off the instance. And these capabilities come together using the power of LLM's reasoning to take a set of predefined instructions, defined at that workflow level, think through the solution, and then orchestrate the agents and the tools until that solution is reached. So what are we doing about it in ITSM? Let's take a look at the pre-built use cases coming in our May IT Service Management AI Agent Collection. Our May AI agents focus on fulfiller productivity use cases, from sending an ad hoc notification with Twilio to fulfilling the request to add or remove users to Office 365 groups. We also handle the gambit of an incident lifecycle. When an incident is created, a triage and categorized ITSM agent can look for major incidents or PRBs and set the proper category and subcategory. At the same time, an investigation and resolution AI agent can find catalog items, similar incidents, and knowledge articles to come up with a resolution plan for that given issue. If a change is needed, we have a full AI change planner set of agents from setting the implementation, back out, test, justification, to risk and impact analysis. And finally, if a major incident gets created, you can quickly write the post-incident report, post-incident review, at the end of that experience using a post-incident report agent. All these agents take advantage of context from within your ServiceNow system and actually take action on the records, setting fields, asking users for clarification, and taking action. Let's take a look at this in demo. Here, we have a major incident. In Power Procure, the shopping cart is not syncing. If I scroll down in the work notes, I could see an AI agent has already categorized this to the software category, but I wanna figure out how I can actually solve this. So I'm gonna go into that analysis panel on the right and type in resolve this incident. And that AI agent is gonna come up with steps for resolution based on those past incidents and knowledge. And we, of course, know that our process, we need to add change. And so we can ask it to go ahead and add another step to implement a change to actually debug the logs and troubleshoot the system. So if we switch gears into a change manager to then enact that recommended plan, that change user can come in, create the change request, select that change type. But now instead of manually typing out all those basic plan details, they can use the AI agent to once again, write all that planning information. You can ask it for changes to the plan it comes up with, add information, subtract information, take specific fields on the form to include, or add or remove specific steps. And then of course it updates it with a human in the loop directly on that form. Now, while these agents in today's demo are relatively supervised, meaning humans are triggering them and they're giving feedback, you can also make all these AI agents run completely autonomously based on a given trigger so that there's no human in the loop, fields are getting set, and the work is happening behind the scenes with these AI agents. Well, our change has been successfully planned. It's time to resolve out this incident. You, of course, can take advantage of regular now assist AI capabilities, like that summarization and go in and see that a post-incident report had already been written. And this is using that trigger capability where at the moment we go to resolved, it's writing that report for you. A user can of course ask for changes. 
So make it more concise perhaps, and then approve that response and set it directly back into that post-incident report field. So AI agents are taking on work in all of your traditional ITSM workflows, whether it's requester, fulfiller, change, incident, problem, and beyond. All processes are transformed digitally with the digital labor of AI agents for ITSM.